back to school shopping. Oh, it's that time of year. Man, it can get expensive. So sometimes you have to go to multiple places to try to find the best deal to get all your supplies. If a dollar store is on your list of places to shop, well, you might want to think twice. I like to just make Hank do it all and then tell me about it later, which is, hey, consumer investigator Hank Winchester doing the shopping for himself and finding out what the best deals we should be looking for. Because it really adds up, right? You've got right. the paper, the pens, the pencils, the backpacks. I mean, you're spending a lot of money for the kids as they head back to school. So what we did is we went to the dollar stores in your community and also Target, Walmart. Where do you get the best deal? Take a look. We compared prices between the Dollar Tree, Target, and Walmart. We're looking for the best deals on some of the most basic supplies. The Dollar Tree had the best deals on loose leaf paper, 150 to 200 sheets for $1. And when it comes to scientific calculators and pencil bags, it's better to pay the lower price at the dollar store. But remember, quality could be an issue. These generic glue sticks might be tempting, but Elmer's glue sticks for a couple dollars more, they're likely worth it. So what other items should you avoid buying at the dollar store? Kids scissors. You can get a four pack of them for $1 at Walmart. And these plastic folders cost a dollar each at the discount store. And at Target, you can get two for $1. At Walmart, they're on sale, two for 50 cents. Don't bother buying three ring binders at the dollar store. They cost 89 cents at both Target and Walmart. And let's compare some washable markers. The Dollar Tree had a 10 pack on sale for a dollar, but at Target, it costs 50 cents for the up and up brand. And at Walmart, a 12 pack of markers on sale also for 50 cents. A tip for all the teachers out there, the Dollar Tree has a lot of items devoted just to the classroom, posters and bulletin boards, stickers, everything you need for grading. Unfortunately, as we know, uh, times are tight for a lot of school districts. Teachers end up spending a lot of their own money yes, to make too. their classrooms look great. Uh, Karen Drew's tip, do not buy the cheap well, glue. I do, I do. I've had problems with the cheap glue yeah. on the art projects. Things have fallen off. Yeah, and It doesn't taste as good as the expensive <laughs> stuff either. <laughs> that's, that's Jason's insider <laughs> tip. Yeah, great. All right, well, there you go. Thank you, Hank. Sure.